Hello friends, welcome back to All in On Law. Uh, this is a medical video lecture, orthopedics. Okay guys, and today we're gonna talk about the comparison, the essential features of uh, bone tumors, especially the osteosarcoma, osteosarcoma, having sarcoma, then we have osteoclastoma, okay, then we have chondrosarcoma, CS, okay. In the previous video, we discussed in detail regarding the having sarcoma and in future, we're going to talk about the osteosarcoma, osteoclastoma and chondrosarcoma in detail and in separate videos. So here we're gonna what you call the uh, what are we, um, we are gonna discuss about the essential features of a common bone tumors, especially these tumors. That's the osteosarcoma OS, having sarcoma is ES, uh, then osteoclastoma is OC, and chondrosarcoma is CS. Okay, because of the lack of space, I'm not able to write it in detail. So I'm gonna discuss the important points over here. So let's talk about the important points. Remember, what's the most common age? presentation right let's make this right okay the osteosarcoma tell me the most common age group presentation at which it presents is tell me it's 15 to 25 remember 15 to 25 okay and the what is the what you call the having sarcoma what's the most common age group it presents as we said it's a 10 to 20 it can go up to 30 years also okay but if you talk about the most common, it's going to be what you call sometimes 5 to 15, some size, like what you call 5 to 15. But remember, it's a 5 to 20 or a 20 or up to 30, you can remember, okay? Uh, if you talk about the osteoclastoma, it is nothing but the most common age group presentation is going to be 20 to 40 years, okay? And chondrosarcoma is going to be wide range, that's a 30 to 60. So the if you talk about the children, the most common tumor being in them is going to be ES, that's the Evings uh, tumor, or is going to be what you call the osteosarcoma, oh, right? So try to think of this. So let's talk about the, what are the sites, common sites, or location. Let me talk about the location from where the osteosarcoma or these tumors arises. If you talk about the osteosarcoma, it arises from metaphysis. Remember, it arises from the metaphysis. Okay, it arises from the metaphysis. Having sarcoma, you know very well, it can arise from anywhere, the most common being the diaphysis. Diaphysis, okay. Osteoclastoma, it arises from epiphysis, okay. And chondrosarcoma, anywhere in the body, it can arise anywhere, any, 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 any. Right, guys? So these are the important, what you call the essential features of uh, what you call the, the common bone tumor, especially we are talking about the location. Let's talk about the common sites from where the, these tumors arises. The osteosarcoma, if you talk about the osteosarcoma, the common sites being the lower end of the femur and the upper end of the tibia. Let me write LF, that's the lower end of the femur and the upper end of the tibia, UT, okay? Right? And the having tumor or having sarcoma, uh, arises from you know it arises most commonly from the ends of the long bones or and uh, what you call not the end uh, long bones okay and it can arise from the what you call the flat bones also but it has also a multicentric origin right so wide range we can call it as a femur tibia pelvis then calcaneum calcaneum and the pelvis are the flat bones from which the having sarcoma arises okay and it can be multicentric also Okay, multicentric, right, guys? Very important point. Remember, okay, and remember the having sarcoma tumor is the most common among the malignant bone tumor, which has a multicentric origin. Okay, let's talk about the osteoclastoma. The osteoclastoma arises from the lower end of the femur, okay, and the upper end of the tibia, and the lower radius, lower radius. These are the common site from where the osteoclastoma arises. Okay guys? 
Then we have osteochondrosarcoma, that uh, most common age group presentation is 30 to 60 years. It arises from the flat bones, flat bones, okay, and it can arise from long bones like upper end of the femur. Right, guys? Excellent. Now let's talk about the clinical features. How do they present? What's the most common presentation among them? Right? The osteosarcoma, the pain is very important. The patient will have a pain. It can present with a swelling. Okay? And the duration of what you call the osteosarcoma presentation will be in the weeks and the months. Remember. Okay? Whereas same patient of Ebbing sarcoma can present with uh, what you call he will have the pain, he will have the swelling, he will have fever, he will have what you call weight loss, signs of um, what you call um, metastatic signs, fever, okay? Why? Because it's a highly malignant tumor of the bone. So by the time you diagnose, the, diagnose it, uh, it has already reached the other parts of the body, especially it has reached to the neighboring bones, it has reached to the lungs, okay? So pain, swelling and the signs of malignancy can be there like a weight loss, remember? Okay, uh, then we have what you call duration will be in a week, months. Okay, remember, and fever will be there as we said. Okay, in osteoclastoma, same thing pain, swelling, and duration will be in the months. Remember, whereas in chondrosarcoma, pain and the swelling will be there, but duration will be in years, months to years. Okay, long duration, right? Right now, most important is x ray finding. If you take an x ray, what's the typical presentation? Osteosarcoma, never ever forget that the osteosarcoma has a sundry appearance, Cartman's triangle, okay, and tumor with the newborn formation, right? If you talk about the having sarcoma, it's gonna be onion peel appearance, onion peel appearance, okay. Osteoclastoma is going to be give so bubble. So bubble appearance. And there will be no what you call newborn formation in osteoclastoma. Remember, guys, I'm not able to upload images, radiological images over here because of the copyright issue. Just to Google the images like sunray appearance of osteosarcoma. Uh, Cartman's triangle of uh, osteosarcoma then you can see the if you, if you look at the images then you will remember for a longer time and you will be very perfect okay guys try to look for onion pill appearance try to look for soap bubble appearance of the osteoclastoma right chondrosarcoma the they will have what you call a mottled mottled calcification within the tumor okay mottled calcification within the tumor Right, what's the pathology? What's the pathology behind the osteosarcoma? Is the tumor cells with the osteoid or bone formation alkaline phosphatase increase in the 50% of cases? A L P alkaline phosphatase is increasing in the 50% of the cases. Okay. And in Iming Iming's tumor, we know the cause, the exact cause is not known, but you see the sheets of round cells, tumor cells with a central clear clearing that's known as a pseudo rosette appearance, right? And osteoclastoma will have a, what you call a multi nucleate giant cells in a fibrous stroma. Multi nucleate giant cells in a fibrous stroma, remember. Whereas chondrosarcoma, they will have chondroblast and a cartilaginous matrix. Chondroblast and cartilaginous matrix. Okay, so these are the important features of what you call the common bone tumors that's osteosarcoma, having sarcoma, osteoclastoma, and chondrosarcoma. If you talk about the treatment, the osteosarcoma, what you call, we give the local ablation therapy and the chemotherapy. Having sarcoma, radiotherapy is really very high sensitive, it do well with the radiotherapy but reoccurs. Okay, and the prognosis is really very, very poor, guys. So you can give radiotherapy and the chemotherapy, okay? And uh, in a, for osteoclastoma, you can give what excision of the tumor and the deconstruction can be done. For chondrosarcoma, local ablation and the radiotherapy. Okay, guys, so these are the important features we talked over here. Uh, because of the lack of space, I may not be able to write over here. Sorry for that. And thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for being patient and watching this video. Please thumb up. Please do share our videos. Please what you call share our videos with your friends and do subscribe thank you so much for watching this video take care